if you didn't got any physical disability on you, which means your two legs and two hands are able to work properly, but you are not exercising, you are not moving because you are lazy, you are wasting the gift that the nature has give you, the gift that the disability peoples or the peoples that become disabled after accidents that desperate want to get, that desperate want to experience. So today, when I go out cycling, after I finish my cycling and race at the race station, so while I'm resting and meditate, I close my eyes and then I heard there's someone walking from the behind and the steps are very slow. The music is playing on the phone because I didn't turn around and see who is that. And I was thinking that maybe it's the old people because they walk quite slow, right? And then when I hear the sound, it's very near from me. I open my eyes and I turn it around and I see there's a young guy who is only around 15 or 16 years old. With his hands wrapped in the bondage, he was carrying like this. And then with his legs walking very slowly along the pathway. And he's very, very skinny. And I can tell maybe because he's having this kind of accident of this disability, he is not able to get the proper nutrition. So how, how does he walk? Let me show you. So his hand is wrapping like this. His left leg didn't able to walk properly. He's only walked with right leg. This is the pace that how he walks, step by step. And then he's not walking that balance. So this is how he walks along the pathway. And then when I see this young man, even though he's in this condition, he didn't give up. He still go out here and the sun is quite bright at that time and he's exercising. A simple move like walking that take it for granted for most of us is a struggling move on his side. Somehow I feel sorry. Somehow I feel I'm so proud of this guy. Even in that condition, he didn't give up. He didn't give up on life. He's still out there exercising, walking, working hard. But many of us who is able to walk properly, who is able to run properly, we are rather choose to lying on the bed, scrolling on the fucking social media, Instagram, watching TV, sitting on the couch, make our body overweight or skinny. We are able to exercise, we are able to walk, we are able to run, but because of laziness, because we take it for granted, we choose not to do it. But the peoples who are disabled, they are really working hard to perform these actions. Imagine when a guy who is disabled, who is struggled to perform a simple move like walking or running, and seeing the normal people walking on the street or running, how does that feel? If they're able to use the money to buy the ability to walk, the ability to run like a normal human, I assure no matter how much is their amount, they are willing to pay for it. But we, 90% of people, most of the people, we take it for granted. We didn't appreciate this gift that the God gave us. The ability to move, the ability to exercise. I will forever remember today, I will forever remember the scenes, even though the young man is having disability, but he is still working hard. So then no, so there is no excuses for me or for you to say something like, I don't have time, I didn't able to make it. If your two hands and two legs are able to work properly, then just shut the fuck up and make your first move. Use your gift. Don't waste it. If you don't do it for yourself, if you didn't have the motivation when you want to give up, remember, there's these kind of people who are having disability, who are struggle to perform the walking. They are working hard. That's all I want to share with you guys today. You only live once, but if you do it right, once is enough.